Good evening, everyone. Thanks for being here for a little bit more jewelry. Let's look and see what else is in this wonderful gift from a wonderful subscriber. Linda, here on this channel, we love looking at jewelry. We love ooing and aahing over it. I hope you do as well, because if you do, this is the place for you. Don't forget to subscribe. Subscription is always free. The little red rectangle is right there on the right side of your screen. Hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to hit the bell as well because here I'm pretty spontaneous and I don't really have a set schedule to pop on so you don't want to miss another video. Be sure to click all notifications so that you never miss another video. We're going to do a little bit of what's left in this box. It's still pretty big so I'm hoping I can get through in about 45 minutes. I don't want to keep you all night. But I'm super excited because I haven't even seen the Heidi Doss. Or how, how do you say that? Heidi Doss or Heidi Doss? I don't know. I've never bought her jewelry, but I know a lot of people love it. And I remember Miss Linda saying, said, saying there was some Heidi in there. So I'm excited about it. And um, it's Thursday. Tomorrow's the, um, what is that uh, proverbial TGIF? So I'm staying up late and just pretending it's already Friday. Let me say hi to a couple of people and uh, we'll get started. Hi, Miss Pamela, Sanja, Anna, and Kathy and Gina. How are you, Gina? Hope you're doing well. Joni is here as well. Thank you guys so much for joining me. Let's get started. Okay, the first thing in here at the top of this box, it says designer watch with gemstones. You wonder how I can contain myself from looking in these things, but I have not. And I still have a wonderful jar. Well, it looks wonderful, and I'm sure it is, from Miss Anna. I want a jar from Anna, who does YouTube videos here, and I've been helping her moderate those. So please join us Monday, this coming Monday. She's in there in the chat. She is Vintage Jewelry Galore. I have a jar from her that I haven't had a chance to open, but I told her I wanted to do a video as well. So maybe we'll do that this weekend. Maybe tomorrow we'll stay up late again. So, okay, let's see what's in here. I have that jar to open, and I found a jar today. Another 1981, or what was it? 19, 1991, which was the last one we we opened. Wasn't it like a weird price like that? 1981, 1991? I found another one today, and it's huge. It's a lot bigger than the one I got last time. But same price, same store. We'll see what happens. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. <laughs> this is so cool. Look at this. Okay, it looks like it may need to go back in there. The little, the little knob came out of there. Probably from just, oh my gosh, it's so heavy. Look at that. That is, I can't read the brand. AK and Klein, maybe? No, here it is. Addie K, Beverly Hills. Oh my gosh, I love the pillow, paperwork, the whole bit. Oh, and look at that crock. Yeah, it just needs to get popped back in here. Get Robert to do that for me. Goes back in here. Wow, that happens when you put things away sometimes or when they've traveled. Oh, I love that, Miss Linda. Look at that. <laughs> I thought it was a Christmas one. Doesn't that look like a Christmas wreath? Guys, how, how is the stream? I almost popped on here without internet because I always turn off my internet when I'm at work. And um, then I, sometimes I'll do a video and I forget to pop it back on. So let me know. I did pop it on. So we should be on Wi-Fi, but uh, let me know how it's looking. And I don't know why it's already saying I have low battery. Crazy. I can't wait to get my new phone. It is on back order, though. It said it won't be here till what, December? Can you believe that? I'll be doing a lot of live videos because I don't have enough memory. Oh, that's gorgeous, Miss Linda. Thank you so much. I don't have enough memory to upload videos on the phones, even if you, you know, share the video or you can't even, what do you call it, airdrop it if it doesn't have enough. It got louder. It got louder. The mic must be acting crazy. Okay, so you don't even have, oh, this pillow is so nice. You don't even have enough memory to share the video. This one says, made in Nepal, Nepal? Look great with a white dress. Oh, wow. I haven't worn a, it's the last time I wore a white dress. I don't think I've ever worn a white dress. My wedding dress was ivory. Isn't that a beautiful watch, Sanja? Thank you guys so much for hitting that thumbs up. 
Ooh, 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 look at this. This is like a, ah, look at this. Oh my gosh, this is like a neck piece. I wouldn't even call this a necklace. Made in Nepal. Look at that beautiful beadwork. Maritza, hola, que tal? Isn't this amazing? Look how beautiful. And look, it's got kind of a Aztec or native vibe to the design, don't you think? It is silk. It looks like raw silk back here. This is obviously hand done. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Yes, yes, the yes to the white dress, right? Oh wow, I would also love it with a tan colored. Oh my gosh, that is beautiful. Just when I thought Linda couldn't couldn't thrill me in with all those rings I got last time, she comes out with this thing. And that beautiful watch. Oh, it's so beautiful, isn't it, Kathy? Look at these wonderful pouches. Let's see what's in here. Oh, my goodness. If we do happen to get cut off, guys, I'll be back tomorrow, okay? Because, I don't know, this phone is just, it's crazy. It's acting weird. I need a new one. Oh, my gosh, i got to put that back with the watch. Okay, we. it says good stuff. Oh, okay. <laughs> She's so cute. Good stuff. Cloisonne earrings, it says on one end here. Okay, how do I open this bag? I'm getting nervous now because that stupid phone of mine. I'm going to use scissors, Miss Linda, because it won't open for me. <laughs> I'm not kidding. It's straight. There it goes. Okay, here it goes. Wonderful little pouches. I love the little suede pouches. They're so cool. Oh my goodness, rose quartz and aventurine bead necklace. Oh, thank you, Pamela. I kind of made it up. I put a, a really lavender color and I mixed it a little bit with red because I've been looking for a perfect fuchsia and I haven't found one. And this isn't quite the perfect fuchsia either, but I never can seem to buy the right one. And then I even often uh, repeat buy the wrong one. Because I'm thinking I'm buying the right one. Do you guys ever do something like that? I do. This is so cold. I love pink quartz. How beautiful is this? Look at that combination. Look at these little barrels. Wow. It's infinite, I believe. It even looks like there's some teeny little pearls there. And they are knotted. This is gorgeous. This is a pretty piece. Let's see if I can show it to you here. Oh, I love it. How pretty is this? Look at that. That is a nice rose quartz and adventuring. Feels great. Okay. Oh my goodness. Again, this was a gift from a subscriber. She sent me approximately 26 pounds of her personal collection. That's why I called it her playlist. Don't you ever feel like your life is a playlist? Snowflake obsidian beads. I do. Today I was playing, um, I, I love my, I love my class. They love all the music I play. One of them said, I really like the voices of the Supremes. I was playing the Supremes' greatest hits for the last hour of the class. And yeah, we enjoyed it. And one of the little boys, again, one of the ones that loves to listen to the latest hip-hop stuff, says, I really love the voices of the Supremes. <laughs> Not bad coming from a 13-year-old, right? He even knew who they were. Obsidian, this is gorgeous. So yeah, I've been thinking about that. Your life is really a playlist. Oh my gosh, that's pretty. I don't think I've ever seen one with so much black. Maybe I've been looking at the Dalmatian. This is really pretty. I love that. Oh, we got some donut here. You hear a symphony? Yes, yes, that one. I love that one. All of them. All of them. It was like, and then of course I was, took time reading the comments at the end. 
And someone was saying they were just spitting out those hits. What you could? What did it say in the comment? I could hardly memorize them because you would fall in love with one of their songs and then poop, another one would come out. Oh, Earth, Wind, and Fire as well. Oh yeah, look how precious these are. Oh my gosh, Cloisonne earrings is all she put on this. But look, the cloisonne is inside this that looks like some kind of a jasper. I mean, uh, like a jade almost. It's very marled though. I don't know. And the cloisonne bead is inside. Look at that. It spins. And then another one at the tip. These are beautiful. And I would have to say really genuine cloisonne. What do you think? And I'm struggling with this um, tripod too. My other tripod broke. Everything is, is needy, in need of a replacement. Look at these gorgeous earrings. Motown, absolutely. Not to mention Sam Cooke, which I listen to on the way to work. <laughs> Wait, some of those are definitely way before my time. Not the Supremes, but... Um, like Sam Cooke, some of his hits are just before I listen to him, but I'm enjoying him now. Look at this beauty. I love this little pouch. It says J-A-I, the John Hardy. This is a John Hardy bag. Nice bag. And this is uh, looks like silver tone, but it's a beautiful abalone. looks like an abalone doublet. That's beautiful. You don't know who Sam Cooke is? Oh my gosh. Bring it on home to me. That's, that's a song I discovered as of late and I love it. Yeah. Actually, Sam Cooke was one that um, Michael Jackson credits as his one of his inspos. He was definitely inspired by the, the very late greats. Silver Earrings is what's on this one. And I think that's when I started listening to a lot of his songs, too, when I heard that. Oh, those are beautiful. But yeah, we sure enjoyed the Supremes today. And then all the beautiful pictures they were showing <laughs> flashing on the screen. I was looking at the pictures. They were doing their work. Oh, these are gorgeous. Look at these. These are onyx. These are so deco looking look at those gorgeous earrings oh miss linda you are amazing she her and i spoke not too long ago and you know she knew i was going to sell some jewelry she said but i sure hope you find some that bring you pleasure i am finding so much pleasure in these i cannot give them up <laughs> for example the one the little cha-cha ring i'm wearing right now i, I love it it's got amber and tiger eye, and that was a gift from Miss Linda in the last couple of unboxings. Look at these beautiful earrings. And I am not a huge fan of Marcus. I love them, I really do, but I'm so deathly afraid of losing them. But the vintage ones seem to be made a little bit better, honestly. They don't get lost so much. Oh, I'm going to definitely keep these. These will stand out against my snow white hair. I love these. Oh. Here's some more. I think these are silver tone little dinglies. I am too, Sanja. I am absolutely surprised. But he did. And it's funny how he commented about their voices. He said, I really like the voices of the Supremes. I said, right? It's Diana Ross. Excuse me. Well, all of them. All of them had amazing voices. But, you know, Diana the Diva. There you go. There. And uh, yeah, we were listening to them. These are gorgeous, very sculptural. These are silver as well. I don't think these are, are sterling. I think they're silver tone. Look how sculptural and pretty though. They remind me of something Halston. I don't know why. I just want to say Halston when I hold those. Okay. Let me dig in for another box. How long have we been on? We've been on. I yak too much, I know. I'm sorry. People hate that. 
Some people hate that. Some people like it. And I can't please everybody. So I just please me. Okay. Pink costume necklace. Look at that beautiful box. How are you, Amy? This little star, this is a Jeep Collins. I showed it last time. Texas designer, sterling silver. I found that in a jar as well. Okay, here we go. This is cool. Oh, I love this. The colors are cute. All kinds of textures. It's just a little costume piece. But what pretty colors. I love this grapefruit color. Something else came in that color the other day that I really liked. Oh my goodness. I think it went off. Didn't it? <laughs> no. Cancel. Are you sure you want to? No. Cancel. Am I still there? Am I still here with you guys? I saw the thing flash. My camera just flashed. So let me know if I'm still... If Yes. Fabulous. Hi, Miss Becky. Good, good, good. Okay. I don't know what in the world the deal is, but I don't have, I have a couple of big bags left, and I don't think I'll be able to get through those. I'm going to do another box. And maybe this little green bag here. What does this say? Turquoise. Ah, oh, yeah. Let's do that. Let's do this one, and then we'll leave the rest of the bag, because there's like three big bags, like gallon bags, and then there's uh, a box. And it's big. So I don't think I can do another. I think my timer is going to go off. Not my timer, my uh, battery. It's, I'm telling you, the, the phone is on the on the brink. The home button doesn't work. It's just a mess. Good, good. Okay, so let's get through the turquoise. Love this bag. So cute. It's padded, too. All right. This one says faux turquoise. No, green turquoise and silver. Green and uh, green turquoise and silver. Oh, it is green turquoise. Look at that. This is a vent. Look at that. It's even got the little rainbow patina on it. This is a small one. She must have worn this one on her pinky. Look at that. I showed you guys my little 18 karat gold flip flop, right? It came in a jewelry jar. That is a perfect fit, Miss Linda. Look at that. Wow. That is beautiful. I'll put this over here for a minute while I wear that turquoise. Oh my God. Hi, Denise. Isn't that amazing? I've never seen one like it. It's definitely green. And there is no mark on it that I see at all. So it's probably from the 70s. 60s, 70s, I would say 70s, uh, maybe even 60s, because 70s they started coming up with the applique of the uh, feathers and flowers and things. They were really a lot simpler in the 60s and 50s with their design, which is the twisted wire, turquoise, um, something silver, copper. Oh, copper. Copper and silver. Turquoise, copper, and silver. I think that's what it says. Went to a Whitney tribute night. Okay, I have Whitney singing the Star Spangled Banner on my playlist, and I listened to that on the way home today. And it just gives me chills every time I hear it. It's just nothing like Whitney. Nothing like what she did with the Star Spangled Banner that no one else could do. And I used to play that version of the Star Spangled Banner at the autism clinic where I used to work. That was our morning meeting song, and everybody loved it. All my kids, they loved it. And I had 18-year-olds there. I had 16, 18, and a 22-year-old. And they stood up for that song. <laughs> they loved it. Look at this amazing piece. This is indeed copper with some sterling or silver applique on that. And some kind of green turquoise. Little cabochons. That's beautiful, too. Look at that. Okay. That is just beautiful. White topaz. I love the copper too, Gina. Isn't it amazing? Look at that. It looks like a, a fashion blouse or something. The way they did that. The color combo, everything. And then this one says white topaz silver ring with turquoise 
beads, I believe it says. Miss Linda, you are just amazing. Not only do you have amazing taste in jewelry, but to be as kind to send me your some of your collection. This is so heavy. What in the world? This is signed. Look at that. Look, that looks like architecture. Wow, it's it's got like a. Let me take off some of these things. It's got like a little cha-cha uh, effect or something going on with it. Look at this. Oh my goodness. I'm trying to read what it says on the inside. I've never seen a ring like this. And it is signed. Oh my gosh. It, oh, it says, it says 925H. NC, no, it has initials. It has LN or LC on the inside there. And then it says 925. And look at that. Is This is the one she said was white topaz and turquoise. That looks like some kind of Asian architecture or something does it not wowie that is just beautiful look at that she is <gasps> unbelievable the the things that she i've never seen rings like this a bag <gasps> doesn't it look like a yes absolutely or a headdress of some sort Wow, that is just so cool. Sleeping Beauty Turquoise and Silver. Okay, let's see that. Wow. Put my rings there. Oh my goodness. Yeah, we've been on a little while now. I just don't want to lose the, the power. I do appreciate you being here, guys. Sleeping Beauty Turquoise Earrings. These are earrings. Oh, those are pretty. Well, those are pretty. They have a little matrix. They are gorgeous. Well, Southwest style. Definitely turquoise. Sleeping Beauty. Wow. Beautiful color. Love those. I hope I can wear them. Let me try my. <laughs> I should be able to wear them. I will force myself to wear them, even for a little while. Those are so nice. Okay. Turquoise and leather ring. She said this was the turquoise. Wow. Turquoise and, and leather? Wow, she's not joking. Look at this. This is so cool. Is this Bars? Yes, it is. I recognized it. Not because of the design, but Bars does interesting designs. That is so cool. It's a belt. Oh my gosh. Why are they called Sleeping Beauty? That was the name of the mine. That's just the mine where they were mined. They have named, it's different, but I mean, it's interesting, but sometimes they name the turquoise after the mine, and then some jewelers will name it further. So it can all get a little confusing, but that's the name of the mine. Okay, this one says blue topaz and silver with Sleeping Beauty turquoise. Good luck, horseshoe ring. Okay, this is not the horseshoe ring, it's a belt ring. That is so cute. Oh my gosh, Miss Linda, um, <laughs> take a drink. Where's my water? Whew, that one took my breath away. Oh, wow, look at this. That is cool. And it's adjustable. And it's signed back there. That is interesting. Now, this one's got, oh, this is Running Bear. I've heard of that brand. This is beautiful too. Running bear. Mostly so and it is adjustable. How unique is that? And I love my horseshoes. 
I have a diamond one with baguettes. I love the horseshoe ring. Always have. Oh, that's a pretty one. Look at that beautiful blue tail peasant sleeping beauty. Little beauty mark there. How cool is that? Let me see who else popped in. Guys, don't forget to give it a thumbs up on your way in or out. Subscribe if you haven't because we do random videos here. We just like to look at jewelry. We don't sell directly here. If you're ever interested in anything I do show in a haul, the email is in my description box. I do have an auction on Saturdays over on Facebook. If you're interested in that, that detail is in the description box as well. But welcome, and I'm so happy you're here. Turquoise bead necklace with decoration, decorative shiny beads. And she put a question mark, like she may not remember or know what the shiny beads were. Ooh, oh, how pretty. This looks like a combination of faux turquoise and real turquoise on some, I think. And uh, just some, this is really pretty. It looks like some kind of glass beads in there. And look, even some, this is so cute. Even some um, AB stones embedded way deep in there. What a beautiful rope, isn't it? That is pretty. That is a pretty one. I like that too. Let me show you that on the display. Wow, it's heavy too. Look at that. Christmas came early. Thank you, Miss Kathy. Indeed, indeed. Very blessed and happy. That is just such a wonderful, wonderful piece and all these beautiful rings. Incredible. Incredible. Wow. I think we're going to leave it there. I think we're going to leave it there for tonight. Look at those beautiful rings. And uh, come back to this weekend or tomorrow when I can. And that way I can put these things away. And oh my gosh. This is so unique. So thank you everyone who came in to look at this amazing collection from Linda who was kind enough to send me 26, approximately 26 pounds of her personal jewelry collection. Just incredible. These turquoise rings are so beautiful. The bars is so cool. I am just so grateful, Miss Linda. Thank you again for just thrilling me to death here. The earrings, the cloisonne earrings, were these just over the moon beautiful? I mean, incredible. Wow, I'm just totally, and the, these, I have to wear these tomorrow. I have to wear these black earrings, and they're not very heavy. Black onyx with marcasite, just incredible. Give it a thumbs up, guys, on your way out. I have a um, estate sale video that I am editing and hoping that it will upload because of my problem with my camera on my phone and my phone on its last leg, but I'm working hard to take it <laughs> to bring it to you rather and um, if not we'll be just be going live we'll do a couple of videos over the weekend thank you guys so much for being here i appreciate it give it a thumbs up on the way in or out subscribe if you haven't and i'll talk to you soon have a wonderful friday bye